We are in a different location today. We are actually at the school that I teach at. Super excited today because I promised my students did. if they smash their end of course exam, I would smash some burgers for them and we're here on site to do it. Yes, we're gonna cook for about 150, 150. 200 students. <laughs> yeah, and does. coming in clutch, Pit Boss just sent us the smash burger kit. So we're gonna break into this. It is gonna be put to use today. So you wanna see how we smash these burgers? Stick, Stick around, around while we, we dig, dig in. in. I can't believe the wall twins. They're right there. That's one of them. That's the other one. I'm the other one. So just kind of want to talk about everything that went on in the day. We did have some popular music playing in the background, so we can't, unfortunately can't get a lot of the live sounds just because, you know, copyright infringement and things like that. But this day was so much fun. Aside from being so scorchingly hot, so hot outside, we really, really loved this and it just enjoyed being able to be with my students. Now, the way I set it up is I knew that 150 students weren't gonna show up and that includes some faculty and staff members as well. But I did know that I did, we didn't want a big swell of people all arriving at one time. So I do teach six periods a day. There are seven classes uh, the students go to but we have a planning period mine happens to be first period so what we did is did an rsvp and had them sign up and let them know that the best time for us was if you were in second and third period to come between 11 and 12 if you were in fourth and fifth period between 12 and 1 and then if you were in my sixth and seventh period between one and two now i did let my students know some of them have jobs some of them have other athletic events things that they had to be at at a certain time, no problem. They could come anytime during the day. This was just my general guideline and I think it worked to perfection. So at uh, one point, one student came, uh, one of my students, Wyatt said, well, I thought there'd be a lot more people here. He just happened to come after one little wave left. And we told him it was perfect for us because we were able to keep the, the burgers going. Now, when we do this, we do eight minute time, Brett and I, because we've found if we try to do more than uh, four burgers each, that'll be make two doubles, that uh, the burgers, once you smash them, will cook all the way through. We're trying not to dry these out. So with the two of us knocking them out, we get a smash for about eight seconds, and then we do a flip, and then once we flip it, we cheese it, and once it's cheesed, we pull. So total time, you're looking at about a minute and a half per burger, and we're able to just get through these, knock them out. First round of burgers are ready. There were a couple times where we had a couple burgers sitting off to the side for about five minutes, but no worries at all. In all, like we said, we fed about 76 people. We fed about 76 people on day one and it was incredible. So here's just some of the sights and uh, just the enjoyment. Now keep in mind, uh, these are students. These are my students. So we don't show a lot of uh, the big groups of students. Uh, so those that came up and wanted to be in the video for sure were able to come and get their food and we allowed that. Uh, the overall event was incredible. In fact, my favorite thing about it is anytime I talk to Brett, he just says, man, your, your students are so amazing. They're so incredible. It's such a positive and fun experience. So uh, it, it really, really was amazing. Well, the day uh, wore out. We got, we wrapped up about a quarter after two, about two o'clock we realized no more people were coming. We got this thing all put together. And then we get a mine. We not need to toss another one on real quick so we can get Hunter. Oh, we need two more? Perfect. Hey, of course, man. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. All right, you too. All right, there we go. Let's get to, oh, awesome. Uh, thank you. You want to scrape your just quick, quick. Here, you want you dab, you dab real quick while I get the salt and pepper? You guys enjoying Saturday so far? Good. What's that? No cheese? Okay, you got it. But still a double, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Double cheese? Huh? All right, you got it. Okay, we got Hunter, we got Madison, we got Hamaya. Yeah. We're doing a cross-off list so we know who's who's coming. Hey, King and Sebastian. I don't think I put King's name on there, but with Sebastian. Put these ones so close together. Huh? Yeah, but they're smaller, I figured. I, I just tried to find a slot that wasn't just cooked on. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So. Getting the next round up. You just take a couple minutes to make. This is my brother, Brett. How this you is doing? Bradley. Nice to meet you, Bradley. I was fortunate. He just came, uh, was it right the second half of the year? Yeah. Yeah. I got fortunate to get him in my class, so. Sweet. Yeah. Good get. Yeah. You get the rock stars, man. Send them my way is what I say. How's your day? How are you? Am I the real Mr. Walton or is it that one? Are you sure? How do you know? <laughs> he sounds exactly like me. What do you mean? <laughs> How's your day going? Yeah, good. Yeah, 
How you doing, man? This, nice this is Mr. You, Mitchell, man. by the way. Mr. Devin. Mitchell. Devin. Nice, to nice to meet you. Yeah, he also, the guy who g gave me a piggyback at Universal Studios. Oh, yeah. So <laughs> that was, that wasn't <laughs> uncomfortable at all. Pull them. The power Put keeps going off, but we didn't have people coming in. Put them back in. Feeding the masses. Smoke wrap for another hour and a half. going. Just like melting your keep shutting off. Oh, you came just in time. It's been non-stop. It's yeah, been non-stop. Yeah. So it's been if, for us. It's yeah, better. Like it's trickles through. Coffee a lot of people been coming, so hanging good. out, playing for a while, and then going. It's so hot out here. So, Welcome, I guess, doing? brethren. Good. We just smashed. We literally just pulled these off the griddle. Oh, yeah. There you go. Those so. are those are hot and ready for you. Heck yeah, man. Dress them however you like. There's waters at the end there too. Military. Hey, you oh, too. Thanks, guys, Thanks for, for coming. By. It's nice seeing Bye. you. Oh, thank Do it. you. Subscribe. Like and subscribing. Make sure you smash that like button. Bye, y'all. That's it? Oh yeah, you like it plain. This guy, this huh? guy, and they're hot. Literally fresh off the oh. griddle. Is good. it good? Oh, yeah. oh good. So far so good. Yeah. We've got a little break in the action, so to speak, right now. We've done about, what did we say, 40 burgers or so? Or 40, 40 doubles. 40 doubles so yep. far. So, eight, so We smashed 80 burgers uh -huh. and um, this is nice, man. Your students are awesome. Aren't they great? This is the best part. Seriously, this is just as rewarding as teaching them. Teaching them but uh, they've earned this reward and love that we get to do this. Man, that smasher coming in clutch. Love yes, that we it have is. It. So is this the towel. Griddle stuff. It looks like more people are coming next round, so let's just uh, let's get at it. Here we go. Hey, how are you, Skyler? You just missed the burgers? just missed the rush. Everybody just kind of came and went, so it was like perfect timing. Oh, yes, of course. Come on. Of course. <laughs> do you want Parker to take it, or do you want to selfie it? However you want to do it. Okay, All right, let's selfie. It. I yeah, love it. Thank yeah. You. I'll tell you the biggest, the hardest part was being so hot and tired. Still got to pack up, clean up, and get the griddle and everything back home. But I had to because the next day, coming back, and uh, we had to make more burgers. They sound exactly the same. My score? One out of ten, yeah. It's a ten. It's a ten, of course. Yeah. Of course. It's really good. Read it one out of ten. This breaks my scale. It's a what? This breaks my scale. It's too good. It breaks the scale? Dang! Okay, well, twins. He said it breaks the scale. It's not yeah. even on one All out right. of ten. Alright, so we're doing it right then? Yes. Nailed it, we'll take it. <laughs> one out of ten. One out of ten. One out of ten. Very much it. And of course. I got another perfect one to relate back. Hi guys. Hey, how are you? Karina and Sheila. So day two, not all of my students could make it, but we still had a blast cooking. It was exhausting, it was hot out there, but absolutely worth it to feed the kiddo. So I'm back at my place. I promised any of the students to still earn their smash burger. I would prep them tonight and Sunday and bring them to them to school tomorrow. So we're gonna cook them, wrap them, and then I'll keep, keep them in my little fridge that I've got on campus and make sure and feed all the kids tomorrow the ones that weren't able to get it today. So we've set up the operation again, ready for round two. Thank heavens my family is here. The smash kit coming in clutch. We got we were using the smaller um, spatulas yesterday. Today I've got the big one and I can't wait. Those salt and pepper shakers are our absolute favorite. So this is gonna work out. We've got our, our we've got our smasher, we've got the, the big spatula, and of course the salt and pepper shaker. So let's go to round two and uh, we're gonna get to cooking. So getting the second wave, uh, my wife, thank heavens, was an absolute rock star. 
coming in clutch and just helping me. All I did was smash the burgers, flipped them, put the cheese on, and then she would wrap each and every single one of these. We had another 70 that I had to get packed into my little fridge at school. So I got them packed into my fridge at home. And then the next morning, Jen again packed them all up in a cooler for me. We got the condiments and everything so my students that earned it, that were, un were unable to make it, still could come and get their smash burger the next day. And some of those faculty and staff members as well. I would love to cook for everybody. Uh, maybe next time, maybe something I'll do for my staff another time. But all in all, this was such an incredible day and event. So uh, I wanted to come in and kind of give some context to it realizing that we didn't have the sound that that we wanted because with the background music again you know copyright is a thing we want to respect youtube and also the artists with all the music so we have our own bed of music underneath and or from licenses that we have and uh both brett and i enjoyed this this was one of the most enjoyable experiences and probably one of those core uh memorable experiences we will have had as the wall twins getting to cook for my students and uh my next year students i'm already looking forward to some sophomores have come and talked to me about what it's going to be like and what we're going to cook next year and i really love doing it so i'm sure we're, we'll figure something else out for that group next week or next year but i'm gonna wrap this up here it was an incredible time and we are both so excited that we got to go and do that. So thank you for sticking around. We know this was a different video than our normal content, but it is grill and griddle season. We're coming into summertime, our absolute favorite time of the year for cooking, although it does get swelteringly hot here in Florida. We put up with it because there's nothing better than getting at the griddle and getting on the good food stuff. I wanted to shout out all of my amazing students that uh, worked so hard on their end of course exam. This was something that they worked for and they really had to put in the work to to get it so either they passed the the passed the exam or they showed significant growth and it was such an honor to get to honor them it was it was my pleasure to get to honor them and i'm so grateful we, we were in a position to be able to do that so shout out to you all for working so hard have an incredible summer and for everybody else enjoy your summer as well and with that i bid you adieu and don't forget to like and subscribe and griddle on hey.